In 1980, Dorothy Stratton, a stunningly beautiful blue-eyed blonde from Vancouver, Canada, was named Playmate of the Year. She was sweet, fresh, charming, and endearingly vulnerable. Those who knew her loved her. A tribute to Dorothy Stratton. Ah, oh, look. <laughs> Becoming a playmate. I just graduated from high school. My mother was in Europe, and there was nobody for me to turn to. I didn't know who to ask. So I just, I took some, some uh, pictures with Ken and it was a Wednesday that he took the pictures, a Thursday that he sent them up, a Friday that they received him, and Sunday I was in L.A. By then, <laughs> my mother was back, and I, hadn't, I was afraid to call her. Nobody knew where I was, what I was doing. But maybe two months before my magazine came out, I told her I was going to be playmate. You're good. <laughs> okay, yeah. Lean onto the couch, Dorothy. Just lean on. Lean forward, lean forward. I love working with the camera. I enjoy working in stills or in motion picture. I feel very natural with the camera. I treat it as another person. I have so much fun also. became one hell of a proud mother, you know? People were calling her and congratulating her, and, and uh, she said, I honestly hope you win Playmate of the Year. It should be mentioned that Dorothy has uh, begun what uh, promises to be a rather, a rather special film career, and she is quite a lady, as you can see, but there's a lot more than what you see here. She is also a very talented lady. 